happy Thursday, happy Vlogmas day two. It is the 2nd of December today. And I have just made myself a lovely, lovely cup of um, tea. It's literally been four seconds and I can't remember what it was. So I'm just gonna delve into the top of the bin and have a look. It's called Mint Refresh. I a spring of peppermint, fennel and rose. How delicious does that sound? And um, the writing behind tea door number two says, cool mint and delicate rose, perfect partners for a winter's day. Yummy. And boy oh boy, it's very cold today. And it's another incredibly busy day. Surprise, surprise. Like, I honestly feel like I, this is the busiest I've ever been in my life. <laughs> um, it's, not, it's not necessarily a bad thing. It's just that I get a little bit overwhelmed from time to time with workloads and things like that. Um, but it's all good. It's all good. Lots of really, really exciting, good things going on. I've just got to learn to manage and delegate in a very organised way. Um, so today, uh, today's video is going to be another sort of like what I eat in a day slash vloggy what I'm doing. Um, I'll give you a little date roundup. So this morning I am going to just have a quick look at my uh, computer and see if I can, f it, it, basically I'm having technical issues from hell and I'm just going to basically try and have a little look and see if I can, see if I can work out um, what's going on and how to rectify the issue because if my computer don't work, it, guys, it's right up there with not having enough oxygen. So, um, I mean, as in, like, importance in me getting my stuff done. So it's really, really important. Uh, yeah, so that's, that's first on the agenda. And then I have to make a little bit of content. Um, I'm actually going to be doing uh, a reel, an Instagram reel. Uh, I was just, like, quickly having a look through the pictures that I did yesterday and they look really great i have a couple more pictures to do i've got a reel to do and then that is that project pretty much completed which is fantastic uh, then i have a load of um i'm self-employed and it's the end of the financial tax year so i need to submit my tax return so i've just got a couple of loose ends to tie up with that when I say a couple of loose ends, I've got a lot of work to do on it, but it's okay, I can get it done. And then I've got loads of like messages and emails and things that need my attention. Um, a couple of like, a couple of admin things that I need to do. And then much later on in the evening, I'm actually doing a super, super fun thing. Uh, a little town just up the road from me has a really, really lovely little sort of like treasure trove style shop that's like um, full of lovely, lovely handmade goods and antiques, collectibles. It's just like a little Aladdin's cave. It is marvellous. And they are doing some Christmas workshops and I'm going with Jim's mum and Jim's sister to go and make uh, a little driftwood Christmas tree which I'm so excited for. It's like gonna be the end to a really busy day where I can just wind down and do something crafty and just, I just think like it's just a perfect time to do it just because I've got so much going on that it's just a nice little thing that I can get sort of like lost in. So I better get cracking. I'm gonna have my, I'm gonna drink my tea. I don't know what I'm gonna have for breakfast. I'm not feeling mega hungry. As of yet, that potato I had last night was massive and it has, um, it's filled me up. So, I don't know, not hungry yet. Might just have to be a brunch day today. But, happy Thursday. 
Happy Vlogmas Day to you lovely people. I completely forgot to mention um, that my uh, arm is absolutely killing me. I was planning on going to the gym today and having uh, a run and a workout, but when I woke up and my arm was just throbbing, literally from my neck all the way down to my fingers, I was like, hmm, I'm not sure that's a good idea. So I'm just going to let my let my arm heal from the jab and just I have a lot to do anyway so I'm just using it as an opportunity to make sure that my food and my calories are like stellar and I will get back into sort of like the habit of working out regularly um but this just isn't necessarily the week for that but it means that I can put my focus into my food so I am currently drinking um, the kale, spinach and turmeric soup by Renourish. I have just filmed a reel with this and um, obviously it needs eating because I've heated it up but I am totally okay with that because it is uh, delicious. Um, so I've just popped it in for my breakfast because I still haven't had anything for my breakfast yet and it's only 155 calories for the full bottle. How crazy is that? It's like literally less calories the most slices of bread for a full soup it's insane and it is so yummy i really don't know how they make them taste so creamy and delicious with all the added benefits that's in it but i ain't complaining um so yeah i've just finished the uh, a reel that i'm doing for them um i've got a couple of photos that i need to do uh, and then it's good to go and then that project um, is pretty much finalised uh, which is great but I'm obviously going to continue to drink them because they're so yummy and so healthy and so low calorie. I'm probably going to have um, another one pretty soon actually because... I need to take some pictures and I don't want to let them go to waste but the really low calorie but they're really filling as well so I might have to give it a little while um, and make Jim some soup for his breakfast uh, for his lunch as well and that should work out fine um, but yeah just just drinking this and just having a second to sort of like go through the other stuff that I've got to get done today um, but you know so far so good very productive I think the next thing on my agenda is to look at my laptop and try and try and fix that because I need that in order to do some of the work that I've got to do today so yeah pray for me guys pray for me so it is now lunch time and I am going to have a, a soup so that I can do my content but also it's really healthy really low calorie and really tasty so i really don't mind um i'm also going to be making some soup for jim because i need to take a couple of photos so i think the flavor that i'm going to choose for myself is going to be mm, i could do with a green one i think maybe uh, i'm going to have yellow split pea and turmeric dal and I'm gonna do gym maybe pea basil and lemon are you sure you don't want to come and choose a flavor no, you can choose uh, I'll do spicy lentil and roasted red pepper maybe there we go uh, I think I'm gonna have the roasted carrot ginger actually so i'm gonna get warming these up and taking some photos so i've just been and dropped off a couple of parcels um from selling stuff on a vintage and jim tracked me to a almond milk latte on the way back which i'm because i love you thank you um and also I've wrapped up my soup project, um, which is fantastic. Uh, they seem really happy with the content, so that is good. Um, so my next thing on my list, I need to do a little bit of work and edit 
the video for today. So it's now 25 to 5 and we are just preparing everything for dinner. Jim has made a super delicious slow cooked vegetable stew and it smells and tastes incredible so I can't wait for a bowl of that. But I've had a request for some Yorkshire puddings so I'm going to whip a couple of them up now and then I suppose we'll it'll be time to eat and then it's going to be time for me to go and do my Christmas crafty afternoon so I'm very excited for that. Driftwood Christmas tree making workshop and here is the finished result. Um, I was I tried extra hard because I knew if it was totally naff, Jim Jim wouldn't let us have it. So I tried my very best. What do you think, guys? It's really good. I love it. Yeah. It was um it was really fun, really fun. So what we had to do was. Um, we had to find the centre of this block. How do you think we found the centre of the block? You do a cross. That's right. And then we drill, drilled a hole in to put the dowel in. And then basically just chose pieces of driftwood and, uh, and did that. And we had to do um, a star, but I couldn't do a star, so I did a heart. Heart's better, better anyway. Thank you. So yeah. I love it. There we go. I had um, a couple of little Venetian whirls. Is that Very what they're good. called? Them biscuits that are like a... Yes. Um, and a herbal ginger and honey tea. It was fun. Your mum and, your mum and sister did really well too. Your mum and Catherine. Very good. Um, We've been playing Rayman. Rayman. A little bit of Rayman. So you've got... Uh, yeah, okay, got Joe's got um, blue light glasses he looks very smart go and show everyone i think he looks like mickey campbell if anybody knows who that is mm, don't. i think he looks very handsome Thank you. well he always looks handsome he does How, have you had uh, some of your chocolate cake yes oh, is oh. it <laughs> that was floss that was, I, I she said no <laughs> I can't blame that one on the door. Yeah, you can. Um, is it really good? Yeah. Yeah. Jersey cream was amazing. I've got I've got a bit of calories left, so a bit of calories. A bit of calories. Bring on a bit of calories. <laughs> so I can have maybe a sliver. It's a great thing about having soup for breakfast and for lunch. You have all the calories for cake in the afternoon. <laughs> Don't they say balance? Isn't that balance? Soup for breakfast, cake for supper. Yes. Sorry, we're... Right, my program's on, guys. It's not been on for 10 minutes. I'll watch it after, though. I'll watch it in an hour okay. and catch up. So, um, where is my phone? I'm get sponsored by Raymond. <laughs> <Watch them. laughs> so, let's have a look. I need to put in... Hey, I need to put in like the little bits and bobs that I had while I was there. I'm gonna say they were Mr. Kipling Venetian Wells. Oh, don't we love kitchen light at this time of the year? It's wonderful. Um, right, so I'm just gonna quickly put in uh, everything that I've had while I'm there so I can assess how many calories I've got left over and see if I can have a little bit of chocolate cake. Two uh, Venice wells I had um, 
came to 290 calories. Um, so I did have some calories left over. So I have calculated that one sixth of this co-op irresistible hand finished chocolate cake is 271 calories. Here it is. Jim came and helped me work it out. Look how small it is. That is ridiculous. But uh, we cut it up and I chose a smaller piece just to be, just to make sure. Um, but that's going to be the last thing I eat tonight. So I will show you how I've done with my calories. So we know by now that my goal is 1,400 and I have consumed 1,374, which leaves me 26 calories left over. Pretty sure I'm not going to eat that. Uh, but if I do, I'll update in tomorrow's video. So if every day was like today, in five weeks, I would weigh 13 stone, eight pounds. Um, so thank you so much for watching today's video. I really, really do hope you have enjoyed it and you are enjoying Vlogmas so far. I think this video will be, this video will be Vlogmas Day 3. I might have said Vlogmas Day 2 in the intro, so I'm sorry about that. I'm trying to get my head around. Um, it being the second today but it's going to be uploaded on the third i don't know anyway pretty sure this video is welcome to stay free but if you have enjoyed it please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't done so already make sure to subscribe for happy vibes if you want to keep up to date with all the latest videos if you go ahead and hit that notification bell um you'll get a notification every time a video goes live and until next time I really hope that you stay happy, healthy and well. Bye guys!